Hey everybody, it is David Townley with Townley Pools, and we're going to be doing a breakfast casserole on the egg. Uh, we're going to have the recipe attached to this, but really we're going to talk about we've got 12 large eggs, two and a half cups of whole milk, we've got two teaspoons of ground mustard, we've got some kosher salt, some pepper, we've got about a pound of cooked sausage with some bacon, five and a half cups of chopped up bread, and we've got almost five ounces of cheese. So super easy to do. We've got the egg at 350. We've already got the eggs beat. We're going to put our two and a half cups of whole milk in there. We're going to put our mustard seed powder in there. We had to come across some salt and pepper, so we're going to put that in there as well. And then we are going to just kind of stir this mixture together and get it nice and blended up. Okay. Then we're going to pour the egg mixture right into our chopped up sourdough baguette bread. Okay. And let that kind of start soaking up some of that egg goodness. Okay. And then also we're going to put some of our cooked sausage and bacon in there. Okay, and then stir that around real good. Hope everybody had a good holiday. This is a great breakfast. You actually want to make this the night before so that it has a chance to set up in the refrigerator overnight and let all that egg, you know, kind of soak into that bread. And then again, we're going to put our cheese in there as well. And get that nice and stirred up and then it's going to go right into our 9 by 13 bacon pan and put that all in there okay we're going to let that kind of get settled out into our pan here and then again we're going to put this in the refrigerator and let it set up overnight and then tomorrow morning we'll get it cooked Okay, we've got it outside. Our egg is up to 350 degrees. We've got the convector in so we can cook this indirect and put the, uh, the pan right on the grates and then we'll close the dome down. And we're looking for about 45 minutes or so. We checked it here. It looks like it was coming along nicely. So we did add some more cheese for like the last 10 minutes so that that would kind of melt into it. And then just took a spatula, spooned out individual portions and enjoy. Thank you.